Meg Volume 32 is storming its way onto newsstands now. Master prop and costume maker Sean Thorson stands tall on the cover, backed by a gallery of his amazing sci-fi costumes found inside. Find out how he goes about fabricating these jaw-dropping creations in his garage. Volume 32 also delves into the realm of design. As more makers get serious with their projects, and some look to go pro, issues like case design and user interface suddenly become important. In this issue, we explore design for makers. From the back seat of a Fiat headed toward Turin, Italy, Make founder and publisher Dale Doherty talks to Arduino's Massimo Bonzi about what constitutes good design and what went into making the Arduino, the microcontroller that has captivated the maker world. Designer and inventor Bob Netzger offers makers a crash course in industrial design, taking a project from a previous issue of Make and designing a commercial-worthy enclosure for it. We also take a look at toy designers past and present, with the revealing profile of iconic designer Marvin Glass and a peek at current toy sculptor Scott Henze. Have you been hearing about BeagleBone, the embedded Linux development board? You want to know more, don't you? We've got you covered with Matt Richardson's skill builder, Get Started with BeagleBone. Matt shows you how to set up a BeagleBone board and how to talk to the world through its input-output pins. If you like your making with a dash of danger, you want to check out Charles Platt's piece about amateur rocketry in the Mojave Desert and our feature on Dejer Molnar's dreams of designing and building a flying motorcycle. In our always meaty project section, you'll find step-by-step -step instructions for building a hot and cold food smoker, a button for generating synonyms for the word awesome, no, seriously, a finger scanning keyless lockbox, and a laminar flow water fountain. Italian designers, rogue rocketeers, flying motorcycles, big red buttons, and secret finger locks. If all this is feeling a little James Bond, it gets better with the World Control Panel. Build this retro swanky toy control panel arrayed with oodles of lights and switches, perfect for the Dr. Nose and Dr. Strange loves of tomorrow. All of this and so much more, over 23 projects in Make Volume 32, on newsstands now, or subscribe at makezine.com.